Okay, it's JDS Sport Talks video. Um, been a while again, because nothing to talk about, obviously, because sport has been stopped by Corona. But um, first thing, main thing, Bundesliga has returned, which gives hope for other leagues returning. I can't see England returning anytime soon because they're still getting 500, 600 deaths overnight. So I don't see how they will return anytime soon. But some other leagues, I know um, League One has officially said no, we're done. But there's hope for some other leagues to return. I don't know if England will, though, as I said, because they're still, they're still hitting them hard, this corona. Now, uh, apart from that, not much has really happened. There's a suggest there was a suggestion about a week ago that England's team could come into Perth and actually finish it. I highly that's going to happen. I doubt the Premier will even... Premier is, like, the head of the state. He... I, um... Doubt he will even let them come in, even if we, like, even if the league agreed and everything else. I doubt the Premier will let them come in because our, our quarters, our borders are closed, and I just can't see him opening them for something that he would find that insignificant and unimportant. The only thing that would do for us is, once this is all over, it would give us probably a better hope of, it will give us more tourism probably. People would know more about WA, know more about Perth, and they would come here from England. Um, apart from that. Not really much to talk about, like there's literally nothing happening in sport. I saw something today when I got home from school, something about Liverpool uh, trying to get some Napoli guy. What was it? Um, it's gone now. Apparently we're looking for some Napoli. I don't know who he is. Apparently it said we're the front runner and trying to get him. I haven't looked at one football, which is the app I use when I'm talking about, when I'm looking at, um, when I'm looking at like soccer related things. Yeah, I don't see it here. Let's see if I can go into Liverpool. I'll cut this out once I, until I find it. Okay, so I found it. Um, Liverpool reportedly in proposition to sign 56 million. But, so I'm guessing they estimate him to be 56 million euros. That's how much they estimate him to be worth. Um, this is Koulibaly we're talking about here. So apparently we're the front one. Why we would need any more defenders? Like, only thing we would do that for is to because we've always had a bit of. I guess confused not the right word, but indecisiveness about who should be with Van Dyke. There's always been I think in my mind it's always been it should currently well last year I thought it should currently be Lovren, but he's out of this question now. I would say probably currently it should be I should be gone now, centre back, it's not gonna lie. It should be um what's his face? Um Matip, but there might be someone else. Is there? No, there's not. So yeah, Matic, and then in the future, I'll be looking at more of a Joe Gomez sort of player for that position. I'm surprised Daniel, we haven't sold Nathaniel Klein yet. I don't know why we haven't. But yeah, that's who I would always thought would be. That's what my plan would always be if I was if my thought of who I would want. Probably currently have Joe Matic with um, Gomez coming in now and again just to get because they always play well Gomez and it's always looked very promising for the future. And then ideally two or three years time Matic would move on because he's getting old and Gomez would come through with another young kid being the next hope for the and then obviously by then we probably need a new one for Van Dyke as well but that was always with my plan but um, I'll take Koulibaly he's a good player don't know why we wouldn't take him so I don't know why anyone wouldn't take him he's always done very well for Napoli I don't know why he wouldn't do well for us there's not been much really to talk about I'm surprised there hasn't been reports of clubs going bankrupt um, one thing, Lois Kellius has apparently um, said he's gonna. Well, not said. There's reports that he's gonna stick out his contract. Um, there's also something here. I see. Um, apparently, there was some thing saying he's gonna go to one of our rivals. I don't know who that rival is. Um, it, what have I had in our rivals? I don't know that. I've never had any rivalry against all that Wonders. Since so when were they our rivals? Whatever. Um, I don't know what to talk about. It's been JDS. Thanks. Bye. See you next time. See ya.